Press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. The Print brings you the top five stories of the day. It's been a hectic week in the Supreme Court. A three-judge bench unanimously declared that adultery will no longer be a criminal offence in India. While it may still be considered grounds for divorce, adultery will not be punishable by law. Justice Chandrachur said that the adultery law, Section 497, perpetuates the subordinate status of women, denies them sexual autonomy and is based on gender stereotypes. Later in the day, the Supreme Court also moved to hear the case on the 1994 Ismail Farooqi judgment. The majority opinion of the three-judge bench held that the judgment need not be reconsidered. While namaz remains an essential practice to Islam, a mosque is not. Babri Masjid and Ram Janmabhumi hearings are slated to begin in October this year. After nearly three dozen resignations over the last 10 days by special police officers in Jammu and Kashmir, the central government has finally moved to increase their pay. However, their pay remains within the scale of 6,000 rupees to 12,000 rupees. A senior special police officer said that the pay hike was nothing less than a joke. Moreover, special police officers remain extra vulnerable to militant threats in the area because they are locals. This is why most of them have tendered in their resignations. Not satisfied with just Assam, the BTP has intensified its drive to introduce the National Register of Citizens in West Bengal. The issue has been extremely sensitive in Bengal since the state also shares a border with Bangladesh. State BJP President Dilip Ghosh told the print that NRC is urgently needed in West Bengal since the state has over 1 crore infiltrators. BJP is mobilizing public opinion and is likely to take the case to court soon. Any government that prematurely dissolves state assemblies and calls for early elections may not be able to announce any major policy decisions after doing so. Earlier, according to the Election Commission's Model Code of Conduct, no government could announce such decisions after the Commission had announced elections. However, the rule is likely to be changed soon. The move will affect most political parties, but especially the BJP, since it has been constantly campaigning for simultaneous polls. This is Deeksha Bhardwaj for The Print.